Testosterone is a well-known hormone that's responsible for muscle building and libido. Now for this reason, uh, people of all ages are looking at ways they can increase their testosterone. Now one popular method is to take an amino acid called D-aspartic acid uh, as a dietary supplement. Now in this video, we're looking at uh, what that is and whether it actually increases testosterone. What is D-aspartic acid? Amino acids are the building blocks of all types of protein as well as certain hormones and neurotransmitters. Almost every amino acid can occur in two different forms. For example, aspartic acid can be found as L-aspartic acid or D-aspartic acid. Now, the forms have the same chemical formula, but their molecular structures are mirror images of each other. L-aspartic acid is produced in nature, including in your body and used to build proteins. However, D-aspartic acid is used in making and releasing hormones in the body. Now specifically, it plays a role in increasing testosterone production and release in the testicles. This is why it's popular in testosterone boosting supplements. Effects on testosterone. Research on the effects of D-aspartic acid supplementation on testosterone has yielded mixed results. One study in healthy men aged 27 to 37 examined the effects of taking D-aspartic acid supplements for 12 days. They also did some tests on rats at the same time. It found that 20 out of the 23 men taking deaspartic acid had higher testosterone levels at the end of the study with an average increase of 42%. Three days after they stopped taking the supplement, their testosterone levels were still 22% higher on average than at the beginning of the study. Another study examined the effects of taking these supplements for longer than one month. The researchers found when men aged 27 to 43 took supplements of deaspartic acid for 90 days, they experienced a 30 to 60% increase in testosterone. Promising stuff, right? But these studies didn't use physically active or trained men. When the study uses trained individuals, the results are different. One found no increase in testosterone in young adult men who performed weight training and took deaspartic acid for 28 days. What's more, another study found that two weeks of taking a high dose supplement of six grams per day actually decreased testosterone in young men who weight trained. However, then a three month follow-up study by the same researchers using six grams per day showed no change in testosterone. So basically, deaspartic acid doesn't seem to have an effect on men who already do weight training and exercise. Deaspartic acid may increase fertility. Although limited research is available, uh, it could be used as a tool to increase fertility in men. One study in 60 men with fertility problems found that taking deaspartic acid supplements for three months substantially increased the number of sperm they produced and its motility. These improvements in sperm quantity and quality appear to have paid off. The rate of pregnancies in the partners of the men taking the supplement increased during the study. In fact, 27% of the partners became pregnant during the study. It looks promising, although that was just one study. We don't know if the, the dose used in that study, which was 2.6 grams per day, uh, is the optimal amount. So it would be nice if uh, someone could replicate the results of that study. There's also been some question marks raised over its safety supplementing past 90 days. So when you consider that, plus the fact the research is really underwhelming, we can't recommend deaspartic acid at this stage for improving testosterone. Perhaps if you don't do weight training, then it helps, but then you might as well just do weight training instead if you can, uh, because that also increases testosterone plus a range of other health benefits. Thanks for watching. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you found it informative. Don't forget to subscribe to Healthline's Authority Nutrition YouTube channel by clicking the red subscribe button below this video.